Hi and welcome to Box Office. Here is where we bring you a few trailers that will hit big in the coming few days. Take a look. Storytelling in all its forms is skewered in Todd Rohel's hilarious The Cataclysm, Cataclysm. A favorite of Sundance, SXSW and BAM Cinema Fest 2011, this divinely bizarre and funny tale infuses stories within stories with wild characters until lines between biblical tales, Mark Twain and campfire stories are historically blurred. From producers Jody Hill, Danny McBride and David Gordon Green, the Catechism Catechism tells the tales of Father Billy, an eccentric young priest who tracks down his high school idol Robbie, an ex-heavy metal rocker who begrudgingly agrees to a canoe trip. As they embark on their journey, it slowly becomes clear that the two old friends might not be as close as Father Billy remembers. When night approaches and they realize they have lost their way, that's when things get weird. rock and roll! You got that, right? Yeah, you're the one that got me into that. Really? When you talked about Judas Priest, that's what made me want to become a priest. Shouldn't we be seeing the out point by now? We passed the bridge like an hour ago. Maybe they'll send a rescue boat. Who? The guy at the store? Oh yeah, the guy at the store is gonna send a rescue boat. Why did you come here? I have nothing better to do, so I'm out here in the woods with Father Doofus. <laughs> Rock and roll! No sex, no drugs, no rock and roll. No. Plenty of rock and roll. Yeah, Robbie! Meet James Quinn McDonough and Patty the Lodger Joyce, related by blood and separated by a feud that dates back generations. As the heads of their rival families, they train to represent their feuding travel clans in their long standing history of violent bare knuckle boxing. Knuckle is a rare chance to step inside one of the world's most vibrant and elusive communities. Travelers are normally silent about certain parts of their lifestyle. Never before has such a portrayal of their fighting traditions been committed to film. Short in observation style, Knuckle presents a hard-edged portrait of traveler male culture and explores the bond of loyalty, the need for revenge and the pressures to fight for the honor of your family name. Prepare to witness the secretive world of travelers and their way of settling scores. No gloves, no padding, just knuckles. I'm gonna beat you, the length of island. I'm the legend, James, not you. Who's gonna win it? James, James, James Quinn. Yeah? James, James Quinn. Quinn. Yeah. Your man will be going to hospital because I am gonna hurt him anywhere I can. We're actually our relatives. Nah, there's will never be something like Not for as long as the Quinn makes it. This is the real legend, James. You're a baldy bollocks. Right, okay. Why, any yeah. Mac do so I don't want to be better than anyone. I want to be better than James Quinn. I have to tour up win for the sake of not just myself, for the sake of our people. The Quinns, the Collinses, the Jaises, we're all cousins. And I think it's a pity you know, the children are just growing into that life. Our equipment do not want you to grow out and fight him and take the head off his body. Two families don't like each other. This is the safest way to sort things out. Because we are men, we are choice men, and with the heart we will fight. No one ever, ever, ever met me. He's fighting the whole breed of people. This is judgment day. Yes! Sorry, no synopsis for this one. The trailer says it all. Take a look. All right, here we go. <laughs> hey, ladies. Hey, oh, it's Katie. <laughs> Katie, wait, wave hi to the camera, Katie. Hey, Christy, you want to say hi? Come on, give, a, give, give us a wave here, Christy. <laughs> Whatever happened to us when we were little, I don't remember anything. 
Whatever it was, it thrived on fear. The more we paid attention to it, the worse it got. Okay, I think it's on. Remember the rules? Yes. Say Bloody Mary three times. Okay, I'm gonna turn off lights. Okay, you ready? Bloody Mary. Bloody Mary. Bloody Mary. Sure that is going to be a huge thriller in the making and I'm sure you have seen the previous paranormal activity movies. Until next time, it's goodbye from the studios.